Have you ever felt frustrated in life? Maybe you're feeling stuck in a job that you don't enjoy, or dealing with a health issue that won't go away, or struggling with a relationship that's causing you pain. Whatever the cause of your frustration, know that you are not alone. As Christians, we believe that God has a plan for our lives, and that everything happens for a reason. However, it can be hard to hold on to this belief when we're feeling frustrated and discouraged. So how can we overcome these feelings and find hope and peace in the midst of our struggles? First, we need to turn to God in prayer. When we feel frustrated, it can be easy to turn inward and try to solve our problems on our own. However, we need to remember that God is always with us, and that He wants to help us through our struggles. Take time each day to pray and ask for God's guidance and strength. In the book of Philippians, the Apostle Paul reminds us to be anxious for nothing, but in everything by prayer and supplication, with thanksgiving, let your requests be made known to God. Philippians chapter 4 verse 6. When we come to God in prayer, we acknowledge our dependence on Him and invite Him to be a part of our struggles. So let us not be afraid to bring our frustrations to God in prayer, knowing that He hears us and loves us. Second, we need to focus on the positive. When we're feeling frustrated, it's easy to get caught up in negative thoughts and feelings. However, we need to actively look for the good things in our lives and cultivate a sense of gratitude and joy. Take time each day to reflect on the blessings in your life and give thanks to God for all that He has given you. In the book of Psalms, we are reminded to give thanks to the Lord, for He is good, His love endures forever. Psalm chapter 118 verse 1. When we focus on the positive and cultivate a sense of gratitude, we shift our perspective from what we lack to what we have. This can help us to feel more hopeful and content, even in the midst of our struggles. Third, we need to seek support from others. Sometimes, when we're feeling frustrated, we need the help and encouragement of others to get through our struggles. Reach out to friends, family, or a church community for support and guidance. In the book of Ecclesiastes, we are reminded that two are better than one, because they have a good return for their labor. If either of them falls down, one can help the other up. Ecclesiastes chapter 4 verses 9 to 10. When we seek support from others, we acknowledge our need for community and our interdependence as human beings. This can help us to feel less alone and more connected to others, even in the midst of our struggles. Finally, we need to remember that God has a plan for our lives, even when it's hard to see. Trust in God's plan, and have faith that He will guide you through your struggles and bring you to a place of peace and fulfillment. In the book of Jeremiah, God promises that, I know the plans I have for you, plans to prosper you and not to harm you, plans to give you hope and a future. Jeremiah chapter 29 verse 11. When we trust in God's plan for our lives, we acknowledge that He is in control and that His purposes are good. This can help us to feel more hopeful and confident, even in the midst of our struggles. In conclusion, my dear brothers and sisters, feeling frustrated in life is a natural human experience. However, as Christians, we can find hope and peace in the midst of our struggles by turning to God in prayer, focusing on the positive, seeking support from others, and trusting in God's plan for our lives. Let us remember that we are never alone in our struggles, and that God is always with us, guiding us and strengthening us along the way.